Okay, it's that time of year, guys. It's spring in mid-Michigan, and it's time for the first fertilizer application. Temps are hitting in the 50s and 60s over the next week or two. Soil temps are about 42, 43 degrees right now. I'm gonna be doing a little bit of overseeding in the front yard, especially with some bare patches and uh, areas I wanna just touch up. But I wanted to get this fertilizer out early and make sure I get it uh, ready to go so that my next round of fertilizer, I'll be ready before Memorial Day. So what I'm using today, I'm using a 10, 10, 10, 10% of everything. I wanted something well balanced because uh, in the fall I did a lot of heavy nitrogen blitz. So um, getting a lot of root development. So I wanted something a little bit less nitrogen, especially in the springtime, I didn't want to push that top growth. And I wanted something a little bit more well balanced, like I said. So I wanted something with overall plant health and structure, and I wanted something that's gonna also help with the root development. So did a little bit of everything. I didn't want something too high in nitrogen. So I, I was gonna start with a granular fertilizer this time, and then I'm gonna mix it this season with liquids. I'm gonna do micronutrients for my next application, as well as another liquid fertilizer for the whole yard. So we'll touch, we'll touch on that next time. But I wanna show you what I'm using. So this is just uh, the general all purpose from Walmart, it's about 18, 19 bucks for the bag. This covers 4,000 square feet. So uh, one pound covers 100 square feet. And my yard, is about, it's about 6,500, 7,000 of grass in the actual backyard. I have quite a bit of landscaping. So there's quite a bit of coverage here. And so I just wanted something that was gonna be durable and just a general all-purpose fertilizer. It doesn't need to be anything fancy. Sometimes the generic name brand stuff is as good or better. And it's also a little bit cheaper sometimes than the better brands like Melorganite or uh, whatever else you want to use Greenview is, is a good one or if you wanted to use some uh, organic fertilizers those are a little bit pricey but they do a good job as well if you want something more organic and safe for the kids and pets things like that so i want to show you what i was using i'm using about a bag and two-thirds to cover this backyard it's about i think the bag is about 6,000 6,500 square feet pearls are a little bigger on these which is no big deal i'm also using a, a cheaper micro guard scott's fertilizer spreader behind me so we'll go over there and take a look at that now. I want to show you something real quick on this. So here's the yard. And as you can see, there's a lot of landscaping back here. So there's not a ton of actual grass when it comes to the size of the yard. But here's what I have for you right here as far as the fertilizer I'm going to be using. Now, this is the, there's no uh, recommended spreader settings on this. And I like to start with setting six, actually. I did five last time for the front yard. But these pearls are a little bit bigger, so sometimes they get clogged. When you open the uh, when you open the little door there that opens underneath and also another thing i don't like to load this up too heavy i don't like to put half a bag in here because this is not obviously the best spreader i mean it's doable for what i need it for right now but it does get kind of top heavy and kind of wonky and a little unstable to move so wanted to do that and just to show you what i was using so this stuff's pretty cheap like i said about 19 bucks a bag at walmart We'll see how it goes. Just a general purpose fertilizer for the back. And then um, we'll just go from there. So all in all, stay tuned for results. I don't think you guys need to see me spray the whole yard or go through the whole yard like everybody else. Just wanted to show you what I'm using and why and, and stay tuned for my next channel. So be sure to like, subscribe, comment below, and stay tuned for the next video. Thanks, guys.